another pass knife. So yesterday we set a goal. We passed 60 knives through QC, which is the most knives we've ever passed in a day. It was a bit of a backlog of all the knives produced over the holidays, um, between the days off and whatnot. Um, but our goal is to get up to about 50 to 60 knives a day. And then we need to get that up to 400 knives a day. So we're moving in the right direction. And you can see on the graph, the gray line is our goal. And as you can see, we uh, surpassed our goal yesterday. Um, quite a few people are off sick today though, so I don't know if we're gonna crack the goal today. Speaking of New Year's resolutions, <laughs> My New Year New Year's resolution is to ship all these Smith blades by summer, and we'll go, we'll go by a vague definition of summer. Summer could be August thirty first, but hopefully July, maybe June. If we can get up to four hundred knives a day, that's only a hundred days to produce forty thousand, which is how many knives we have to produce. So it is possible as long as we can get up to those production numbers. We've solved a lot of the issues that have been causing problems. Um, we have a new tumbling process that reduces the fails because of scratches significantly. So hopefully me doing this final QC check becomes a really quick stamp of approval versus a check everything before we ship it. It's obviously being checked during production, but right now, at least for the founders, we're doing a full 100% inspection by me at the end. So with all those passes, we have successfully made 183 Smith blades so far. There has been a little delay in shipping because we just got our approval under Kuzma, the Canadian, US, Mexico free trade agreement, which means American customers won't receive a tariff. The problem is, turns out shipping companies aren't very good at actually handling this. And there's a chance that we'd still have duty transaction fees even when there is a very small or no duty. So we've been figuring out how to fix that, but basically that means there are a bunch of founders knives going to the US that need to be shipped into the US and then shipped from the distribution center to the customers, which will eliminate the tariffs, I think. It's complicated, but things are in motion. We are doing our best to avoid any possible tariffs where possible. Um, and yeah, in other news, our customer support tickets, we've made it through at least half of our backlog. Um, and we are accelerating. We're getting faster at responding to tickets. We've hired three people to help with customer service. So if you haven't gotten a response yet, don't worry, it's coming. It's not gonna affect your ship date because we're still a little behind on production. So I think that's that. What's your New Year's resolution? Me or the audience? Let's go with you. More videos. More videos. That sounds like my resolution. <laughs> no, that doesn't sound like my resolution. That sounds like something I'll have to do to make you meet your resolution. <laughs> I'd be very disappointed if we don't ship by August. So the, the reason being is that it's very realistic to ship a lot earlier than that. The, the true bottleneck is the machines. And we made a bit of a breakthrough there. The program has been optimized a bunch. So we should be able to produce 500 a day from the machines. Now, currently the real bottleneck is assembly and we've made some improvements there as well. So now we need to hire a bunch of people to ramp up that production. So if, if you're looking for a job, check out the website. It's under career, go to hacksman.com under careers, hiring both CNC operators and assemblers. Um, so now that we can ramp that up, I, I think it's realistic to get to 500 a day uh, on the CNCs that's running 24 seven on the assembly. That's gonna be two shifts uh, running seven days a week. Once we get more people in the door, we'll be able to get that flow a lot better and get those numbers way up. And with 500 a day, that's like 70 something days. So it's, yeah, if we're, if we're not shipping all the units until August, that would be quite a disappointment. 
What, your, uh, what brings what brings you to the shop office, man? What's going on? New Year's resolutions for Hacksmith. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay, okay. On the realistic side, though, like I really want to get all the fab equipment and everything all set back up, and like you know, get that get that whole party going. Just like uh, I'm sure others have been saying, there, I'm excited to get the knives out, but I kind of also miss doing like projects. So that'll be kind of fun to get back to. Oh, uh, stop drinking Red Bull. Yeah. <laughs> That's a pretty good one. Oh, All of the Red Bull oh, over here. And he has a, the, the nerve to be like, Brother, Brody, 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 we're going to need to switch your resolution over. My resolution was more projects. <laughs> Arguably, I'm prepared. <laughs> I think I'm ready. No, don't. Nothing to see here. Nothing to see here. I want to design. And I want to design a hacksmith. Can we get me without this cut? Uh, New Year's resolution. Um, play less Apex Legends. Hacksman New Year's resolution. I would love to start a new big series this year. Uh, finish up Power Armor and then start something new. I want to do more anime projects for the, the weebs out there, you know, shout out weebs. And uh, I want to collab with more e-girls. Probably like make 40,000 knives. <laughs> yeah. Make 41,000 knives. Woo! Jeez. 2026 resolution for Hacksmith. Yeah, let's make the 40,000 knives. Um, and let's hit that target and get these customers happy. Running more machines, making more, uh, making more blades. That's it. This year, I want to try to drink as few Red Bulls from work as possible. I want to hit uh, our benchmark of making 400 knives a day. Get all the machines up and running and have everything running full tilt. Getting all the night ship and getting tickets down <laughs> and sleep. Work hard on uh, getting the knives out. <laughs> Get to like a reasonable ticket number. <laughs> I don't good. know what a reasonable number is. What, but... what are we at right now? Uh, like 1800 like a hundred would be nice <laughs> I'm actually excited about this product here uh, this is a 24 25 ish in one and it's cool because you can it just looks uh, as you can see the size here um, yeah we'll see if we can put this here or not hopefully early 2026 but we'll see by the end of 2026 I want to have mini saber v3 launched and so uh, I'm looking forward to that one New Year's resolution for work is to try and have people catch things on fire less. Everything within the building, down below, electronics, um, contractors' forklifts have been catching fire this past year, so nice. that's on my list. Nice. No more fires. No, no more fires. Please. <laughs>